Hello and welcome to this Profumator Corrosion PM8500 tutorial. Measuring with rod electrode. On completion of this tutorial, you'll be able to do a half cell potential measurement using the rod electrode. The following information applies to the rod electrode only. Step 1. Select the rod electrode. Step 2. Define the grid spacing and dimensions. Step 3. Adjust the color heat map. You can do it by sliding the bubbles. Or by tapping on the potential value. Select the value, then press OK. This value will be adjusted in the color heat map. Remember you can also change the color palette by tapping this icon. And the measuring pattern by tapping this icon. Step 4. You can select the auto save mode to save automatically the values once they are stable. If you do not want to use this mode, you can always disable it. Then you will need to manually store the values of each individual cell. Step 5. To start measuring, press the circular play button. Step 6. If auto mode is selected, the values will be automatically stored. Just move the electrode to the next spot. If auto mode is disabled, you will need to press the circular play button to save the measurement. Then move the electrode to the next spot. Step 7. Keep doing the measurement. You can also see the live measured potential at the top left corner. Step 8. To stop collecting data, press the Stop button. You can either confirm to stop collecting data or continue scanning. Step 9. To keep scanning, press the circular play button. Step 10. Keep scanning. Once you reach the end of the line, the probe indicator will jump to the next line. Step 11. To delete a previously stored cell, long press it. Then press the trash icon. The value will be deleted. Step 12. If you want to remeasure the value of that cell, double tap on the cell to reposition the probe indicator. Then press again the play button to start measurement. Step 13. You can jump from one cell to another by doble tapping over one cell. Then press the play button to resume measurement. Step 14. Once you reach the last cell, the whole scan will be stopped. Step 15. You can modify the measured potential considering a temperature correction. First enable the auto potential shift, and then select the ambient temperature. The heat map potential will be automatically adjusted. Step 16. You can also manually adjust the potential values. To do so, disable the auto mode and select the potential shift value. Now, you know how to do a potential measurement using the rod electrode.